Hi everybody, it's Teresa here from Apex Training Institute. Today I'm going to talk about referencing. Um, here at Apex we need to meet um, quality standards. All assignments must be referenced. This is a um, standard throughout Australia for all schools, universities, training colleges, um, Yes, so all your work must be referenced. So I'm going to show you how you do that and what our reference formatting is here at Apex. So because you're only at a certificate and diploma level, the referencing isn't that hard. It's quite simple, really. Um, and we've made it pretty easy for you because we've actually, when we create our resources, we've referenced them. So all you need to do is... Um, put the reference to each question on your assessment. So I'll explain how to do that. So I'm just going to use here ECE 001 today, the first unit that you do in your assessment. So I've already downloaded the um, assignment. Now the first few questions in this assignment um, are about yourself. So of course you don't need to reference that, okay? But when you come up to questions like... Sorry. Okay, here's a good one. Question three, the early years framework describes cultural competency and the ability to understand and learn. Um, please click, um, sorry, please complete the following. According to ELF, what does a cultural competency um, impose? So you're not going to know that, right? So you're going to have to look it up. So what you should be doing is going to your um, reading mater um, material, your PowerPoints, learner guides and sorry I should have downloaded this beforehand you're gonna click on that now I cannot stress enough all your information are in your PowerPoint so please stop using the internet and if it's not in the PowerPoint it will be in the second folder in here below um, so you just click on that Oops. Sorry, and see here you've got all your extra resources. I strongly recommend that you get a USB and download all these because you will need them for placement and you will also need them when you work in childcare later on. Okay, so I'm just going to get rid of this. So here is my PowerPoint, as you can see, and here is my question. So <clears throat> I'm just going to find the... Um, Um, okay, cultural competency. Okay, so this is the answer basically to this question here. So all you can do, the uh, PowerPoint is in a word format as well. So you can just do like this, go straight cutting to pasting over here. Oops, there we go. And all you need to do is just type in, in brackets, Apex PowerPoint. Okay, I'll just make that a little bit larger so people can see it. See, that's all what I did, just Apex PowerPoint. So this one here is select one of the skills above so that you need to work on. So of course you can't reference that. But like down here, you again, you're not going to know this um, question. So you're going to go to your PowerPoint. Here's the answer here. And you're going to do the same. Okay, so you're going to... Copy it, and then you're going to Apex Power Point. Okay, so you must do it for every question that you need to reference. Okay, please do not do this. Please do not at the end of your assignment over here, please don't just put Apex PowerPoint, Apex resources. This is not acceptable. Or please do not put um, all your references at the end because I will not know when I'm marking what reference goes to each question if I need to have a look at it, okay? Now, say if you needed to go to the internet to find something, okay? Um, here is a good one, like... Um, there's a research question. Let's, I'm just going to click on this to make it bigger. Um, I'm just trying to find a research question. Sorry. Um, sorry. Okay, 
let's pretend we are going to look at um, sorry I'm just trying to okay let's pretend we're going to look at the Aboriginal um, Indigenous people okay so outline what Okay, let's just pretend this is a different question. Let's say this question says research about Aboriginal culture. Okay, let's just pretend that this question says this here. So you're going to have to research, of course. So you're going to go to Google and you're going to go to, um, let's say, um, Aboriginal culture. Okay. And let's just say that you're going to go to this website here, okay? Sorry, my internet's very slow today. Okay, you might look at this and go, yep, that looks pretty good. I'm going to use all of this information here, okay? So you're going to go and, oh, I don't want to add the photo. <laughs> but you're going to go cut and paste this to your assignment here okay so as you can see that's quite a lot of information okay you are actually not allowed to do that that is classed as plagiarism what you were meant to do is you were meant to read all this information off the website here and then you're meant to put it in your own words then once you do that, you come up to here, up to your toolbar, you copy the website so I can go back and check. So let's just say we changed all of this. Okay. And that's the information we have. Oops, sorry, I'll make that bigger. Okay. So I'm then going to go in brackets below. I'm going to cut and paste the web link. So then I know with that question there, that's where you got your information from. Okay. I hope this gives you a better understanding on how to reference. Um, so I will have to resubmit your assignment if you do not reference, okay? So there's no way of getting out of it. All students must reference their assessment. If you need more help with it, please email myself or Apex Training Institute and we're more than happy to help you. Thank you very much, everyone, and have a great day.